Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. My name is Nick, and today we're going to be checking out a new band that I have not heard of before called The Perfect Circle. Now, my patron Taylor, who originally turned me on to Tool, and I have been doing uh, some Tool reactions here for the first time ever, loving that journey, just recommended that I check out uh, Maynard's other band, A Perfect Circle. And I guess he's got two other bands or had two other bands. But I'm excited to see what he's like outside of Tool. Um, and then I guess additionally, the guitarist in this, who's Billy, uh, I wrote it down, Billy Howard. Uh, yeah, Howard, I hopefully I'm pronouncing that correctly. I guess was the technician for Adam, um, Adam, yeah, in Tool. So for Adam Jones. I guess that's the whole kind of like synopsis right there. But um, nonetheless, I'm very excited to see what this is all about. Thank you so much, Taylor, for making this one happen. I really appreciate the guidance. Uh, just a quick reminder to go subscribe to the original band. So after you finish watching this video, I'd highly recommend going to check out A Perfect Circle, hitting subscribe, and watching one of their videos. Uh, but if you like what you see here, I'd ask you to do the same. Uh, support me. Leave me a comment. I would love to hear from you. They do mean the world to me. Okay, let's hop right into it. Three Libras. right there a couple of lines I threw you the obvious to see what occurs behind the eyes of a fallen angel so I'm testing you I'm testing you to see if you're even alive essentially if there's any soul left in your body or your being basically seeing if you're still human to me do the bare modicum in regards to going about um, life and engaging with me. Um, now, I, I'm seeing this contrast in the scenes. Thank you to the music video for helping me out here a little bit. This boy that's sort of left on his own, got no one to play with. He's got the, you know, the sailboat. And then um, I'm assuming maybe his mom that's in a hotel room is sort of doing other things, but um, is sort of neglecting him. Um, I can I can totally see how a younger kid 
would try to test their, their parent, you know, throw them the most obvious thing, the most simple task, just to see if they give a shit anymore. Um, again, that's just my interpretation. It's probably completely wrong, but, um, you know, this is so fun to sort of dissect what Maynard and uh, this band is trying to accomplish with these lyrics. Um, his voice sounds so fucking broken in this, um, and that's intended. It's, it's incredible. Um, you can feel the sort of pain and, and resentment. Um, we'll let this play through now, but I just wanted to talk about that. I mean, so this is Maynard back when he's younger versus who he is now. So maybe I got that interpretation a little wrong, but it almost looks like he's uh, like in a womb of some sort. The way that shot as a kid, he's like tucked up in the blankets, but he's basically still just um, developmentally delayed almost, you know, just because of the, the shit he's gone. And by development delayed, I just meant like from an emotional standpoint, I stunted because of the shit he's gone through. Uh, I'm not saying that's what actually happened to Maynard, but, um, yeah, very cool tattoo as well. like apathy at a certain point towards life, you know, walking through a crowded room, people staring at you, wanting something from you. You don't see me for who I really am. You don't see me. You don't see me. You don't see me. Um, shot of a, you know, a drink falling to the ground, wasting your life in some hotel room. I'm sure the tours that Maynard's had to go, you know, have been, has been a part of in terms of being a musician have weared on him over the years if I had to guess a lot of musicians struggle with that idea of being on the road and you know their fans are incredible but maybe don't see them for who they really are behind closed doors the pain and struggling I'm a you know you could there's countless people who have struggled with a uh, depression in the in the public eye um, even when they seem to have everything right um, goddamn. A couple that come to mind, like John Frusciante, um, not a musician, but Anthony Bourdain, uh, Kurt Cobain, people like that, uh, that have really just struggled with coping. Not comparing him to that, um, but yeah, that video has brought up a lot of, um, sentiments and, um, you know, forlorn feelings. Um, Taylor, thank you so much. I really appreciate you for pointing me in the direction of uh, Maynard's other band, A Perfect Circle. Three Libras, I'm going to have to think about what that could mean. I don't even have a guess right now. I was thinking about that during the song, so 
Um, leave me a comment if you want to try to enlighten me. I'd love to hear from you guys. Thank you so much. Quick reminder to go watch the original right now uh, while you're thinking about it, and I will see you next time. Take care.